Yo, what up, YouTube? I'm just gonna come at you real quick with a quick little video on um, something that could help you in this game uh, with your longboat. I mean, you could do it with your your little boat too, but longboat's more expensive to make and kind of a bitch if you have to keep on remaking it. Um, this is my third longboat that I made so far because every time i would go out and do something and i wasn't on my longbow or whatever i would just go out and get wood or ore or stone or something oh actually look it did get destroyed so okay perfect example that's what happens boys That is what happens, okay? Um, so... Oh, <laughs> uh, fuck, man, I'm done. Why am I not regening? Oh, I'm still uncovering. Okay. So. <laughs> this is what you want to do. I've tried multiple, multiple, multiple things to try to make this work. This is the only thing that I've found successful. Keeping the mobs away. I've done docks. I've done like multiple different docks. The building system in the water is kind of scuffed right now. You can't build while you're swimming. So it's fucking hella hard to put pillars in the water if it gets too deep. Um, so this is what I ended up doing eventually. Now this is going to take a little bit of time. A little bit of work. But in the long run, it will save you a lot. So what you want to do is you want to find a little spot. On the edge of the water and what you do is if you take a pickaxe and you dig down into the ground on the edge of the water if you dig down to where as soon as you dig you start swimming that is just deep enough for your boat to sit in it and not take any like ground damage so when you take the pickaxe And you just dig down as soon as you dig and then you're swimming like okay, it's uh, mine shit's done but now you're swimming you can't stand anymore that is perfect depth for your boat not to hit the ground okay so you, what you want to do is you get a little spot on the coast you you dig out with the pickaxe all and now like i said it takes a lot of work man but you dig out all around and like um let's see one two six six squares across for one boat i would say is good you could do smaller but i wanted to make sure that i could put a chest here for stone and stuff in a stone mason so that because once you finish this of course you need a hole now we don't have gates in this game yet i hope they come out with it in the c update but we don't have gates um so what you have to do is another thing it's kind of a hassle but it's worth it i think is just take stone uh, you're gonna want to take stone and you're just gonna you know place it in front of it and you want to make it high enough another thing that people were concerned about was um You know, if the waves come in because the, the storms in this game are like nutty. Like that. Super easy. I'm overweight. Need to do this anyway, so. They need to make it to where you can build in the water. It's, it's kind of kind of nuts that you can't. 
now no mobs not even trolls could get in and believe it or not it takes forever for them to break stone i mean stone is like hella fucking strong and i ended up putting spikes along the edge there too on the bottom on around the corners um so if they did come near it would kill them but they don't even really come near um okay. this is perfect it fits perfectly in here i can get it in here boom another little tip for you guys um is on the boats your turning radius is on the back side of your boat so every time you turn you're turning the back side left to right the front is going to go wherever the back you know eventually lines up with so one way to get your boat in here like smooth is to pull up pull up past your your little dock area and then back it in nice and nice and easy back it right in because when you're backing it in you're pretty much like turning a car it's very 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 easy to steer it um if you don't back it in you're gonna fucking run into your walls you're gonna do this you're gonna do that it's gonna be hectic um not that it would really matter because you repair it but well you want to make it look clean you know but yeah this is my advice for anybody who is trying to keep their longboat safe from mobs um because there's been three times where i went out and did something i left my boat out there in the water and i come back and it's gone the cargo's there but all the mats are gone especially with the iron nails and shit they sink to the bottom so you no know, it takes 10 iron bars to make this boat not a lot but 10 iron bars 10 iron bars man you know hey take two hours out of your day and, and do this and you're you don't have to worry about it anymore unless you leave the door open like my dumb ass did and freaking i was sitting here trying to set up and the damn mobs came in and destroyed my boat but anyways yep yeah, that is uh, a little th a little thing for you guys you can put a roof on it you can you can do whatever you want with it i just kept it open because it doesn't matter but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed it um you know let me know in the comments if it helps you because I've, I've looked up videos and there's no videos on youtube so um i figured i'd try to make one for people that are trying to figure something out what to do with their boat so but I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, make sure you guys follow, you know, subscribe, follow. I, I stream, so make sure you subscribe. And I'm going to put my Twitch link in the bottom. I stream every day, Monday through Friday um, at 5 o'clock EST. And, you know, come by and say what's up, man. We're going to be doing some really cool things in my streams. I've, I've downed all five bosses, so I don't have a lot to do in the game. So we've been doing, like, arenas. We built a big arena. Uh, we we're building a castle right now a pretty big castle for like the server that we're on um, So yeah, we do some pretty cool stuff. Make sure you guys stop by hope you guys have an awesome day